Alright, and welcome back to another Kuma Style Review. I'm your host, TJ Duckett, and today we are reviewing the Head Robots Blood DX Upgrade Kit for the Revenge of the Fallen Deluxe Bludgeon Toy. Let's go ahead and take a look at what we've got here in the box. Okay. And just balancing out there. Alright. Okay, we have the tank barrel, which also becomes the sword. We've got the canopy, part of the tank, a crotch plate for them, as well as a holster for the sword in robot mode. And can't be complete without the new head which is really cool because what's nice about this is it has the option of popping out here reversing going back in there and it's a completely different face just like the one for the Voyager kit so with these parts it will make your Deluxe Bludgeon go from this to this. And as you can see, um, no matter which head you use, it's definitely a more faithful homage to the uh, Pretender Bludgeon with the skull face, helmet, Shogun helmet, things like that. Um, definitely has a long sword. And taking a look at the back, to where his turret goes. His turret, since the sword actually goes in there as the front of the barrel, it actually acts as a holster. And speaking of holsters, going ahead and moving this arm up. And sorry for being so, it's not necessarily gentle with mine, but the arms on mine are really stiff and anybody who knows the transformation knows that if they're stiff it'll lift like the whole upper half of its body up so that's why I'm trying to be careful so this thing doesn't just fall apart for while I'm trying to do a review so okay moving this arm up alright and you can see right there that there is another object at the top of the holster and we'll pull that out it's kinda hard but there's actually a small knife there too. So I'll go ahead and put this in his left arm and get his arm angled back down. But yeah, all in all, like the badass factor of this figure with this set just goes up immensely. Immensely. And I, I love it. I am absolutely enthralled with Bludgeon and the way that he looks you know, what having this set added on. So yeah, take a good look at the front too. So you can actually see what he looks like head on. Okay. Pour his arm some, but yeah. Like I said, he's definitely, definitely a ton more badass now. Out of control badass even. And so, yeah, I mean for a 30 something dollar kit, what this adds on to an already awesome mold, it, it, it's out of this world. So, yeah, most definitely. It's a must, must buy. But before I let you guys go, I do want to take a look at vehicle mode. And alright, here is the alt mode with the Blood DX kit on there. As you can see, it turns into a more stylized tank with the big long barrel and everything like that. Um really my cup of tea as I I'm not really into Transformers with, with such dead on military tank forms but you know it, it looks good and I love that especially with the pieces and whatnot they really 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 got the colors to match so yeah it's it's a nice looking set I mean they did great take a look at it from all sides yeah nice long turret gun on the side. In fact, every piece is actually still usable. Um, 
alt, during the alt mode besides the head, unfortunately. So, yeah, that stinks, but at the same time, it is a little bit big for the compartment that it fo that folds down when you're transforming, so it's understandable. But yeah, overall, very, very cool kit. Like I said, $35 or so, well worth it. And this is, once again, the Head Robots Blood DX Kit. It's an upgrade for the Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Deluxe Bludgeon Toy. Or Wreckage, even. But, unfortunately, the green parts like the turret and the canopy and whatnot, they don't match that um, white and gray camo molding of that one. But, exact same mold and the parts will fit either way. But, once again, this has been Kuma Style Reviews. This is TJ Duckett. Check out my website for this video review as well as a full pictorial which I would say is quite dandy. That site's going to be www.kumastyledesigns.com or follow me on Twitter. That's at KumaStyleGFX, KumaStyleGraphics. Thanks again for watching, guys, and have a great night.